Hello everybody! Hello everybody, it's David aka Dablorito. How have you guys been? It's been a while since the last sit down video. Today, I wanted to tell you guys a story. Story time with David. I really like orchids. Um, I'm not a huge plant person, but orchids are our bay. They're bay. They're bay. I have seven babies. Babies, as in orchids, okay? And um, I have three of them with me today. So this is number one, number two, and number three. And today's story is about this baby here, number three. Stop! <laughs> Don't go away. Don't think that this video is going to be plants only. There is a message behind the story, okay? So listen carefully. Here's the story. I bathed my, my orchids. Three months ago, this orchid looked like this because I accidentally brushed off what's this called this part with, with, where the flowers come I don't know the English term I accidentally like you know it was chopped off but here's the story <laughs> I I tended to all of my orchids the way I used to but with this one I gave extra care because I was scared that she might die or not die, but sh that she might not have any flowers this summer. So all of the others were growing and beautiful and you already saw the, the flower buds and everything. Well, this one didn't have anything. So I gave extra care. You know, I, I talk to my babies. I, I really do. I talk to them and tell them <laughs> to grow beautifully and nice and strong that they can do it. I bathe them, I let them lay in the sun sometimes. <laughs> that sounds so weird! Oh, it's, it gets even weirder. I sing to my flowers as well. But not on a regular basis, it's just once a week or so. Um, on bath day for the flowers. On bath day. So yeah, I'm really struggling and I'm having a hard time to speak because I don't know how to do this anymore. I have to get into it. Anyway, um... I'm just sitting. I'm not doing anything. Anyway. 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 Uh, I can't speak. It's so difficult. <sighs> Long story cut short. You can see. Ta-da! Done! It's wonderful. It's beautiful. It's my orchid of the month simply because look how many, how many flowers, how much fighting spirit this orchid has and look it has more flowers than all of the others. I guess the moral of the story is and the reason why I wanted to tell you this is sometimes in life it doesn't work out the way you'd want to. Sometimes your ray of sunshine, your hope, your beacon of light, your free ticket for a buffet. <laughs> no, just kidding. But whatever it is that has been giving you hope and you've been ho holding on to, sometimes it's just destroyed, broken off, it doesn't work out. It may be your fault, maybe it, be, maybe it is someone else's. It doesn't matter. That shouldn't pull you down. That should not hinder you to achieve your goals and to keep on fighting. Orchid here, example. <laughs> With the right attitude, with the right mindset and environment, and I think also the people that you surround yourselves with. From this, when everybody else is laughing at you and saying, oh, you don't have any flowers, you don't have any success whatsoever, you can prove them wrong. Just continue doing what you do and believing in yourself. And then over time, this will come. And... Yeah, I think that's the moral of the story and that's the reason why I went I don't even know why I wanted to tell you this story Now that I'm filming it, it doesn't seem so much fun as it was in my mind I just hope that you understood the message of this story It's not really about orchids, I'm just using them as an illustration But if you have orchids and it's not working out well Just, just hold on and tend to your orchids 
and for everybody else if you have any goals and it doesn't seem to work out and people are discouraging you or whatsoever don't don't focus on the negative but hold on to your hope to your dream to your goal you can achieve it you can do it and then when you do you'll see the price and then you'll be happy <laughs> and um yeah I think that's it. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope the message came through. Don't forget to give my video a like because I also have dreams, okay? I also have goals and you giving a like helps me to achieve those one step at a time. And of course, subscribe for random videos <laughs> such as these. Um, no, just subscribe. I personally believe that I really do cool videos, um, my travel videos. I personally like them. I enjoy editing so much. And yeah, you should subscribe. You really should. And other than that, I wish you all a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be. See you soon. Adios. Kumai! so weird.